Why am I going to Unite to Face Addiction on October 4th, 2015? Well, in large part because this was me. This was me in about 1995. It's my last booking photo. Pierce County Jail, Tacoma, Washington. You see the lost look in the eyes? I was lost. <laughs> I was facing multiple charges. I was headed to prison. I was scared. Because of family, friends, institutions, I have a life today. I have a great life. Here I sit in 2015 in, in a, a home I share with my amazing wife. I have an amazing career, one that I could have never dreamed possible when this picture was real. But listen, addiction, active addiction is ugly. It's like this. It's ugly, right? Recovery? Recovery is amazing. And that's why I'm going. Because I want to speak loudly that we have to change in the United States of America how we treat addiction. We have to stop the criminalization of addiction. We have to stop the failed drug war. We're pumping still billions of dollars into a drug war that has zero effect. What if, what if we took that same money and put it into treatment and just kept treating people, just kept going until they got it? We'd still save money, right? So I'm going to speak loudly about these things I have strong, strong passion about, that I have a strong passion about, and that is changing how we view addiction, changing how we view recovery, what we think recovery looks like. We, really, the average person has no idea. We've got to come out of the shadows and speak loudly about the millions of people in recovery. We've got to speak loudly about having different ways of treating people instead of just one or two ways. We have to speak loudly to our lawmakers and get them to help us shift in America how we treat addiction, how we treat recovery. That's why I'm going, and I'm going to be excited to be there and to see everyone else there and to make positive change in this area.